So, Metal Gear Survive is out. It's the uh, first Metal Gear game. Excuse me. Uh, I believe, unless there's a pachinko machine or some something like that, that uh, has been released since Kojima uh, Productions is disbanded and Ko well, Kojima is no longer with the uh, with Konami. Words. He passed away. What? No, uh, no he's oh. he's alive and well. He's just not with that shitty studio anymore. Well, that shitty company anymore. Which is a shame. They used to be great. Um, actually, I don't know if they considered Metal Gear 5 a Kojima production. Or they scrubbed his name from it. They scrubbed his it. name. Yeah, they game, scrubbed his they? name from it. Yeah. yeah. Um, so, Metal Gear Survive is a... Some people gave it fairly decent reviews is but this it, a whole new game or is it like a it's a, a whole new game okay. it's uh basically a mine for materials survival game you have to have water and food and fight zombies and do all that it's shit un, it's uncharted uh, no that's not uncharted uh not, but it's not uncharted <laughs> not uncharted the fucking game where you go explore and get mined for shit not uncharted. what the fuck i'm out of it not uh, not Minecraft either. Not my, no the other one. You're exploring the universe. No, it's not that. <laughs> Anyways, oh never mind, Pat. Um, uh, it was, what the hell was that game called? That flop. Anyway, No Man's Sky. No, no, Man's no it's Sky. not. This no is Man's No Man's Sky. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> anyway, um, I'm loopy. Yes, you are, and I that, am too. What's been that pizza I ate before the podcast? Yes, it was it that was spiked. It was that bean you had? It was spiked, and not your cat. Uh, <laughs> so, anyways, I, it's not so much the game. People have talked about it leading up about how it's a cash grab. Obviously, we're going to talk about more about why we're going to talk about two things. Uh, one, how the developers couldn't resist taking a shot at the company they were working for. But two, oh, yeah, I read about that. But two. Uh, more importantly, is just how bad the microtransactions are in this game. So you can pay for additional uh, like troops to help you. You can pay for additional perk slots. You can pay, basically, you can pay for all sorts of stuff to make the game easier. You can sort of do the pay for win, pay to win sort of stuff. Although okay. you, you say you can pay for for save slots, is that what you just said? Not yet. Okay. I didn't say that yet. Okay, so you can pay for additional. <laughs> you can pay for additional. We'll get there. You can pay for additional perk slots. You can pay for additional oh, help a on per, a perk slot. Yeah. What the fuck's a perk slot? Like extra abilities. So not the abilities themselves. Slots to hold, hold the, the abilities. abilities. Yes. Like that would be included with the ability. Right, you you can pay for slots what to hold more abilities. It's like okay, I'm I'm buying special ammo, but I need to buy the special ammo clip to hold the ammo <laughs> in my gun. So what the fuck? That's all pretty ridiculous. Although a lot of the reviews have said that it's not necessary. Um, but what is really bad is yes, Pat, you blew the reveal. Uh, although I think most people oh, I was would zoning know this out from when yeah. you said perk slots. I said it sounded like save slots yes. to me. You can buy... It comes with one save slot. You can buy additional save slots for $10. Each. $10 each. 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 $10 each. 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 <laughs> yes. Is Konami the scumbag song of the, the week? week? I think, I think week. retroactively, week. Konami is, is the, the scumbag, scumbag seller. Surprisingly, the scumbag seller of the week, week. is Konami. Yeah. Charging $10 that for save slots. That is insane. Yeah. It, that is... That should be criminal. That should be criminal. Yep. And I'm sure their excuse is, well, it's a survival game, so you no. can't have multiple save slots. Well, it's not realistic? Yeah, because it's not real. I'm sure that's their excuse. But like it's zombies not are and, and, and fucking carrying uh, 8,000 rounds of that <laughs> on your person when you're running around in 25 different weapons at one time. That's realistic. Right. So fucking idiots. It, it's absurd. And it's also a way to. It, it, in reality, it's you know, Monster Hunter has multiple save slots. Frank's even upset. Okay, Frank fell off. If Vani wanted to play Monster Hunter on my PlayStation Network account, she me. could. She could go in, create her own character, and play. This is basically 
uh, opposite situation. If I were to buy Metal Gear Survive and Vani decided that she wanted to play, she'd have to pay an additional 10 bucks to create a character on my Okay, so let me make sure. You can't earn, what are these, SV coins to get save slots? Apparently, for the first week, they've been giving some away as like a login bonus. But <laughs> I, I don't think that's going to be the case after like the first two weeks. So you can earn these coins in the game? No. You can't? No, it, uh, at least reviewers have said they have found no way to earn the coins in the game other than... So the they've first... been giving them out like a fucking drug dealer giving out the first free hit. The For people. like the first couple weeks, here. supposedly, oh, they're here. giving earn some half away. Earn half a save slot. Here. You I can, would not... feel good to be able to save. I would game. not count on Konami to be giving away even that many. This is insane. Yeah. This is fucking nuts. Yep. Is this, is this the peak? It, it went from... DLC being unnecessary, but you can comp- complain about the price structure going back to like Street Fighter fucking four costumes. Right. Stuff. Charging, like, oh. charging five bucks for four costumes. It's a fucking palette swap or whatever. That's kind of dumb, but you don't need it. Now it's going to necessary items that you couldn't dream of them charging for that you're now accepting. And this is only the matter in the matter of like five years. It's it's swung this fucking far. Pay ten dollars for your strong attack button to work, or you can just go through the game using weak attacks. All I right. mean, <laughs> can I activate my right trigger button for three dollars? Like it's, it doesn't function. Like to unlock that. <laughs> uh, Is that where it's gonna go to? Uh, yeah, I mean, it's it's a possibility. Can I pause the game for 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 twelve dollars? But apparently, possible? apparently we're not the only people who are mad about it. Because I there, would think not. Ian, there there is a a fun little. Uh, uh, Easter egg in here. So when you start the game and you put your name in, um, it shows your name being added to a list on a clipboard. And if you uh, take the first letter of each of the last names on the page, other than yours, it spells out KJP forever, which would be Kojima Productions forever. Well, that's nice. Which is pretty fun. That's fantastic. Um, but even uh, even more underneath that. Uh, two names, uh, Bastard Yoda and Cunning Yuji. Uh, the uh, Survives director is Yoda Tsutsumizaki and producer is Yuji Korekado. So they're attacking the producers of the game? And both are listed as AWOL. <laughs> Whoa. And without leave for those out there not familiar with military parlance. And, uh, and then... Um, and then uh, this article says a little deeper. If you take the first letters of the last names of Iron Marlin and Dyer Gibbon, you get MG or Metal Gear. Both soldier- soldiers oh. are listed as KIA, killed in action. Okay, so... Jesus Christ, this is unbelievable. So is this a case of, of Konami obviously biting up more than they can chew, thinking that uh, consumers will accept this l- level of ludicrousness and now there's going to be finally pushback because this is all. This almost seems it almost makes the Battlefront two thing seem cute. That oh, it's, it costs way too much time. It, it, it takes way too much time to unlock Vader and Luke Skywalker. Now though, these we're talking about in-game elements. As someone's calling me, uh, who's actually decent looking. Um, damn it, I can't answer the phone. Um, <laughs> that never happened on the podcast before. <laughs> Wow, Pat got a call from someone. I, You know, but this is how DLC progresses. It starts with something like Street Fighter 4. And we're all like, this is ridiculous. And now that sort of stuff is stuff that people, if they want to pay for it, they don't bat an eye anymore because it's been around for so long. Sure. So, it, so then new DLC comes out and we think that's ridiculous. And like you said, it makes previous dlc look quaint and non-problematic so we just so, got through something is, as ridiculous as battlefront 2 and now major backlash where there's major backlash but now we're looking at something even more so ridiculous this is wow this is a theme it's like oh it's getting used to school shootings but so, this is dl awful dlc yeah so now we when does it become at, regular right when is this acceptable we look at something like this and enough of this happens and then all of a sudden the battlefront 2 stuff just becomes acceptable I'm not saying this is as bad as a school shooting before you come. I'm just saying no, it's just what, been a reoccurring when theme it starts reoccurring, you should you should be you should always be angry by it 
at the tenth time. You shouldn't get used to it before used you it. become numb to yeah, it. Yeah, it, it's, it's a whole frog slowly boiling, whatever. You slowly raise the temperature. Oh, it's okay. I'm not cooking from the inside out because it's happening slowly over a you know a period of time. So, wow, Konami, woo! I'm so glad you don't work there anymore, Pearl. I'm so glad my Pearl isn't working You've there anymore. You've really been bringing up Pearl a lot lately. Have I? A lot? Yeah. Last podcast, you brought her up like twice. Oh, well, we talked about Konami. Yeah, sure. You know, so. All right, here's to you, Konami. Make those extra uh, dimes and pennies. 